Hello everyone, and welcome to the modding series Creating Your Legion for Total War Attila. In this series, I will be teaching you all of the database modding skills that you will need in order to be able to create a custom battle overhaul. Today, I'll be teaching you how to create a custom faction for custom battles. We'll be going over the database entries, the text entries, and the UI. First of all, we're going to create a new folder on the desktop and name it TWC Series. We'll open it and we'll copy the directory. Now we're going to go to data.pack and we'll... Uh, I did it before but open data.pack scroll down uh, open UI then open flags and just... Uh, I know, just grab the second one and now go to here and open it. Now you don't need these, I don't think you need these DDS files, I'm not sure what they do, so just delete them and now here's the flag but we're gonna override it here's a terrible flag I made before just blue, green and an eagle it's seriously bad because I'm not artistic but it's good enough so we're gonna override it and save and we're going to downsize it, resize it to 64 by 64. We're going to copy that and we're going to open this one and we're going to override and save it. And we're going to open this one, we'll go back and we'll downsize it to 24 by 24 now. And we'll override it and we'll save it. And so now this is our flag. We'll go back here and we'll change this to TWC series and so we've got the flag all done now go to the UI folder and copy the URL now open pack file manager click file new and we're going to start making our pack now let's save it as TWC series and now right click on it click add directory and paste that directory in and now you see you've got ui flags twc series and we've got the free icons save that now we're going to go add from pack and we're going to make sure it's on total war Attila data and we're going to scroll down to data.pack and we'll expand this go to DB which stands for database and expand that and scroll down to factions table here and we'll right click on that and you can see it says DB factions table factions added now we'll scroll down to oh no now we need click OK now right click again add from pack <coughs> go to local English pack expand it, go to text db go to factions.lock and double left click on it then OK and now we'll delete all of these entries except one and we will do the same here, we'll delete uh, we'll delete all of those and so you want the faction screen name and the faction screen adjective and so we've got Abar Shahar, Abar Shaharik and we can change or delete all these I mean delete um, uh, yep and now right click and click rename and you have to add a prefix for example just TWC and same for factions TWC and save it again alright so now we've got what we want so we're just going to call the faction alright so now 
make sure you don't have combo boxes on make sure it's like off and we're going to rename it uh, just TD TFPC series um, we're going to choose this has to be a random number that nothing else is used Like zero zero with one. Uh why isn't that a valid number? Uh there. I maybe you can't have it too big. But yep, we'll have that. Uh this stuff is campaign stuff, so we don't really need to change it. We'll change the name to TWC Vikings and the screen objective uh I just do the same. Uh, name group that's that stuff is campaign this will change in a later episode flags we change it to TWC series and all of this stuff is campaign stuff uh, primary color oh we'll change that I'll have to check what my input is before we do it and then you're attacking the Vikings, you're defending against the Vikings, and so yep, we've got that down. Now we go to text, uh, what's it called TWC Vikings, uh, TWC series, let's just change it to Vikings. So here we're just adding th what the faction will actually be called and these are files to do that. Um, and so that's finished. I, uh, I just realised I forgot something. You have to make sure MP Youth Republic Early and MP Youth Republic Late are both ticked. If they're not ticked the unit won't even show up in game. And so now our faction should be working in game. We won't have any units, but we should be able to see it. Alright, now we're in game. Go to custom battle, factions, and you can see it's here. TWC Vikings doesn't have any units, but we'll add them next episode, I think.